to get some pet food. They are in the <laughs> everyone um this is a little tour of our caravan because we put the wall up so you couldn't necessarily see it on the time lines. um here's the tent it's just a regular tent we have an own ensuite bathroom so that is good um so we obviously put the walls up on the caravan barbecue in that bag bridge um, we've got, it hasn't really tied much stuff up yet. Um, yep, we've got, that's the aircon. We've got dining table over here, couch area, beds up on the And that is the what are you two doing? We're setting up our beds. Ah. We're doing our beds. We're in the tent tonight. Yep. Uh, okay, I'll do that. Okay, so. The playground. Lots and lots of different things. Here's on this little monkey bus slide thing. Zoe and Mum are over at the slides. We've got a little pirate ship on there. We've got a little caterpillar type monkey bars. Who's on the flying box? What is even better is that just over there is our caravan. So just crossing over the road and then we're at the playground and we can go to the gym pillow. But way up at the front of the um, park is a pool and there's also a water slide going into it. So we're really looking forward to doing that. We'll film a bit of that later. Yeah, we'll film that later. It's a bit Italian, <laughs> even though we're in Australia. Mm -hmm. Pasta Remo and cheese. Mm. Mm. Aha, we should have pizza instead. So, we're at Alice Springs Reptile Centre. Now, I was looking in the book, but I found this place and I asked if we could go to it. So, we're here today and we're going to check it out. This is Terry, it's not water crop. Mm -hmm. He was bought here in 2002. He's been here for about 20 years now. He's a male yes. and he's 30 years old. But I don't like the ground. Oh my god, I did not see that. Hello, little oh. mate. This one is food. I found five. Um, there's one that's like an orangey green sort of colour and the other one's like a brown, whitey, blackish colour. There's one here. I think I should. 
Yeah, these ain't no beards. Ain't no beards from the world too. And the final one is just here near this longish thing. Guys, hi. Me. There we go. Yeah, I'll stay there. Is that your life? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's explore all these pink botanic gardens. Botanic garden. Botanic. 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 I want to say botanic. It's not botanic. <laughs> What is it, Zoe? It's Emu. Emu. I have seen something. Hmm? We've uh, seen some poop and we've seen a metal emu. Hmm. What do you think the poop belongs to? Uh, the metal emu. It's <laughs> but I don't know what it's from because, like, it's probably from, like, a wallaby or something, but it's too big. So maybe I think there might be a couple of rock wallabies that have gone up the past this way into the far mountain in the distance. We figured out who the poo belonged to and it was a rock wallaby and it says in the sign there's snakes, piranhas and wall rock wallabies will be up in like the rocks because they snakes and lizards and goannas will find that a really good place to hide and rock wallabies could bounce around and just enjoy their time. Where are you going? I've got the swimming pool. You got the swimming pool? Whose thongs are you wearing? I wear Leo's. You're wearing Leo's. <laughs> are you done? Yes. One water slide and you're done. Yes. Too cold. No for a swim? <laughs> Isn't it a bit cold? Zoe? Big cold! <laughs> So it's about 5.20 in the morning and we're leaving the caravan park now to go for a hot air balloon ride. We're going on this ride for Mum's birthday because it's Mum's birthday in two days. Point on the Rangers, everything west is West Max, everything east is East. So, we've just landed after a horrible flight 
the moment the two captains are, or the captain and his little helper guy, his little assistant, they're pulling down the balloon now. And we're about to have some breakfast. It was really, really fun. We saw some kangaroos, we saw lots of wildlife. The views were magnificent. You can see there's little clouds and stuff up there, those patterns. It was even more magnificent watching the sunrise over the west and east McDonald Ranges. But it was really, really, really fun. It was a really good experience as well. What's Liv doing? She's rolling. <laughs> I was rolling in the hot air balloon. And what did that do? That made all the air come out of it. Was it fun? Yes. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers to our hot air balloon experience in the outback. We've just gone down a massive pothole. Dad and Mum are out seeing if everything's okay. Still got everything attached because otherwise we'll have to go back and see if we've lost every anything. That's what they're doing right now. Zoe's just d eating again. And Liz's doing a bit of reading as well as eating. Look at it, Chippy. You are eating the teddy bears, aren't you? Okay. Was everything all good, Dad? All good. <coughs> We're all good. Dad's now going to leave Mum on the side of the road. <laughs> it's all good. <laughs> so. So, you're thinking about doing both of these? Between the guidebook of Panorama. Two hours and two kilometers, 2.5. That's only 4.5. Okay, we so were thinking about doing this, which is 3.5. But, but we're here and it's over here. And we need so, to walk the whole way around down to here, which we're not going to do. We're going to grade four. The first one that we're doing, so this hard one is grade four. And then the second one that we're doing, which is the easier one, is grade three. Yeah. I can't believe we started down there and now we're up here. That's cool. Top of the mountain. Oh, we should go with it. Okay, we're packed up at Alice Springs. Have we got everyone? Roll call. One. Here. Two. Big Mac Waffle. Three. Here. Four. Zaza, that's you. Me. Me too. You two. Betty, you four? No, I two. Okay. <laughs> Come 
run ahead to get a really cool action shot of the car coming along all the corrugations and Stu did a U-turn Kind of like it's lovely, tells the history and everything, but it's just uh, untouched by people. Like there's no one here. But it's definitely interesting, wasn't it, Libby Lou? Yeah. Yeah. So we're doing some cooking. We're just going across now. Dad's checked and he said that the sand should be okay. Oh. Okay. And we're almost there. Almost out. Yep, we done it. So we got past that. Okay, bye. Bird. Okay. Hurry up. You're welcome. Well, your dad doesn't just eat a bird. Yeah. Cool. Oh. Let's go. Not a nice animal. Not a nice animal. I feel sorry for that bird. Boy, that was sick. The building, so the roof on it, that's obviously new. They've rebuilt that, they haven't rebuilt this though. They've just left it. So, oh. how does it get warm? Heat. How, where, how's it heated? It isn't. It isn't. Right, they've all got chimneys. It's doing here. The workers. That's stupid. Yeah, what? what are you doing? Got one more rock. Yeah. It's like crystal. Yeah. Do you know what they used to mine here? These rocks. Yeah, but you know what they found? Back in the day, they used to find gold and rubies. Cool. Think but we now, find any? Pardon? Think we can find any? No. Oh my god. That actually does. Is it a piece of toast? 
Alright. Time for some fan tales. Go, Zachy. Come on. Zach. Have a nice chill afternoon. Other being, um, uh, well, we were, have just like basically stepped back in time and gone through this walk. It was only like 10, or, 10 minutes or so, 10 to 15 minutes, and we basically saw things that they used to do like in the early days. <laughs> Here we are in the wilderness playing 40 40. Leo's looking for everyone. Zoe's giving everyone away. What if we're laughing? We're behind the bed, it's running. What if we're laughing? That's hungry. Darn it. Mom. Did you get hungry? No, she didn't. Where's mom? Zoe, do you know where she is? There. Where? There. There. No, she's not over there. The know. old there. Here's the 4040 finder. Down to one. Just doing some sunscreen over here. There you go. Good, good, good. That's a lot. Put it on your arm. On your arm. On here. Doesn't tickle. <laughs> <laughs> no. No, it's gentle. Oh, Mama Chap is an ant below you. Oh. Like just down there, Mum. Oh yeah, that's a big one. Where? Where? Backpack. Your backpack. Um, hi everyone, we're back at Trofina Gorge doing the second walk. Um, it is a bit smaller, it's 2k and it should take an hour of return. Me and Zach joked about a parenti the other day, but we're not joking. Okay, we see that. It's an actual thing. Oh it's like an actual one. Imagine if I'm just coming up like a bush. Wild. Well, it's wild. It's not that big. How is it not going to spark to the plant? I've got really tough skin on you. Alright. Okay, well, let's keep my feet. Not every day you see a parenti. <sighs> Boy, that is gross. That definitely counts for a little bit. Can you see the parenti? No, can you see? Show mum, where is it? What is that? Parenti could kill. Parenti came for you, Zoe. It's alright, I'll save you. I'm your parenti. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> we got just a little bit off track. Um, after we saw the parenti, we had to go down a hill, then we had to come back up it. And then there was a cut where we weren't sure if it was left or right. And then we chose right. And we've been finding some more of the markers that we need to go, that we need to follow. Because we're on the orange tracks, so we need to follow the orange markers. We've got a, maybe 20 minutes left of the walk. 
Um, but yeah, so we're all good now. Got back on track for the moment. I've been a few prickly bushes and stuff though along the way. Um, yeah, they've been really our only worries at the moment. But now we're being flooded with the orange markers. I've also been, I've also had a little bit of a fright because grasshoppers keep jumping out from in front of me and I don't know what they are until I finally saw one. They were just very, very, very sneaky. Someone needs a bit of a Me treat. Curry. I really enjoyed our hot air balloon ride. It was really fun. And I'm thankful for Dad to actually, for actually booking tickets. And he didn't even get to go and he booked tickets for us just for Mum's birthday on the special big trip. So that's really nice. It was really fun to hold a snake in the rock house. Yeah, I really enjoyed doing that as well. Zoe, did you like holding the lizards? Yes, Papa. You did like holding the lizards, didn't you? Uh, uh, you like the snakes? <laughs> you like the snakes? And that's You like the snakes? I enjoyed all the bumpy roads. Really? Yeah, because it was really uneven and I like bumping up and down. I don't like that. That makes me feel sick. We also enjoyed having a lot of space at Ross River because it was practically what? empty apart from us and maybe three other groups. Right. And also we didn't like because the pool was really dirty. There was even like, these many little scorpion things in them. Yeah, the pool was dirty. Oh. I was thinking about not jumping in and then he pushed me in. Yeah, then you wanted to. We also learnt, um, I learnt how many people are killed a year in Australia by snakes. It's only two people out of maybe 25 million, but in, I can't remember if it was Pakistan or Sri Lanka, they've got around the same population as us, it's 21 million, and 25,000 people a year are killed by snakes. Upper six rate, Alice Springs and the East McDonald Ranges, four stars out of five. We really like the hot air ballooning and Leo liked the bumpy roads. We like seeing the parenti. We all, I think we all enjoyed that apart from Mum because it ran out and scared her. Mm. <laughs> the Altunga Drive, we were really annoyed because there was no shelter or anything whatsoever when we did all of the walks. It was really, really hot and the flies were definitely annoying. That's probably lost the star. We would definitely recommend going there though. So bye. can you say bye? Bye! Bye! You come out fossicking king with your binoculars. What are you looking for? What is it? I don't know. It's, it's, like, it's crystal. Look. Wait, no. It's mm. it's in the light. I don't think we can take this rock home though. Yeah. <laughs>